Hello guys, today I'm going to review Linux Mint 7.3. If you're going to switch from Windows to Linux, you can surely go for Linux Mint. Obviously, you all know that the Linux is nowadays more popular operating system than Windows. You can download Linux Mint from this website. The link is going in the description. You can choose any desktop environment you want to choose. I will go with the KDE as I like more customizations. Here is the community support. If you have any problems with the Linux operating system, you can go with the community and ask your question. Also, you get the chat support in here, conversation. So, all in all, you get all these things free of cost. Coming to the softwares, you get pretty cool softwares pre-installed, such as VLC Media Player, Amrock Music Player. Then, for Office, you get LibreOffice support. For email, you get the K-mail. Also, you can use Thunderbird, which I prefer the most. For graphics, you get GM Editor and DigiCam. So, you get all these things pre-installed. You don't need to install any software. You can say that Linux Mint is ready to use out of the box. If you need any other software, you can go to Software Manager, go to any other category, or you can search it here and install it. So it's as simple as that. Coming to the File Manager, Linux Mint uses the Dolphin File Manager. You can resize this icon by just dragging this button. You can see that. Okay, so that's good for updating your operating system you just need to click this icon you will get the updates install the updates you're done you can add the widgets as well to the desktop let's put a widget right Here it is, you can move it, resize it, do whatever you want to do with it. Okay. Now coming to the customization part. Linux Mint KDE is purely customizable. You can change anything you want to change in your operating system. Let's go to application appearance. Go to colors and let's choose this one. Or you can download it from here also. If you have created any screws, you can upload it to apply it. Change. You can change icons, fonts. Those are the things which will be covered in the next video. Okay, go to workspace, cursor theme. You can choose any of this. I have chosen this oxygen blue. For window decorations, you can choose any of this or you can get new decorations also you can change the desktop theme okay. so I like it see that or you can download new themes as well well you can you get all the desktop effects in here all effects uh, yes here is Wobbler Windows and Desktop Cube is here. You can just stick it and apply it and it's done. So you can say that the Linux is surely going to replace your Windows operating system. Once you install this, you are not going back to Windows.